Hey, hey, YouTube. So today I'm going to be doing a get to know you, but um, it's going to be in a mukbang form. Excuse me, sorry. I know I butchered those two sentences. I'm doing a mukbang, mukbang, however you pronounce it, while answering some questions. That's what I'm going to be doing. Do you guys like my wig? Done by me. This is my first wig. Well, not my first time wearing a wig, but my first time like doing a frontal wig by myself. I think it's really cute. But anyways. Ooh, where are the questions? Okay. So Oh, and for the mukbang, what we're going to be eating is this little mini Red Baron pizza, personal pizza, some Oreos, some mucho mango juice from Arizona, I think that's what it's called, yeah. and then from the calf, some chips and guacamole, and if you know me, I love chips and guacamole. When I was working at Chipotle, they put me on. Let me tell you, I'm not a salsa girl, but some guacamole, I'm on that. So I'm just cutting my little mini pizza. It kind of looks like, this is my first time eating this, by the way. It kind of looks like something you would see out of like elementary school, you know, like a little, an elementary school lunch. That's what it looks like. It tastes like one too. Hopefully, I don't spill anything on my shirt. I'm gonna be trying to eat like extra careful. Oh, wait, there's a roll of paper towel. Cause listen, food always ends up dropping on me. Well, I'm not gonna manifest that right now, but a lot of the time, food ends up dropping on me. I'm a messy eater. I'm working on it. Okay, so the first question is my name and age. My name is Kiara Jeremiah. I'm not going to tell you guys my middle name. <clears throat> Just know it's very common, like extremely common. Um, my age, I'm 20 years old. Dub club. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. But yeah, I'm 20 years old. This is actually really good. Like, especially like the crust part. I'm the type of pizza eater that likes like the crust more than the actual pizza. So this is good. So where was I born and where where do I live? I was born in New York, Long Island to be exact. And currently I live in Florida. I live in West Palm Beach, Florida but I go to school in Tampa. <clears throat> yeah, I've been living in Florida for the past, like, I think like 15 years or whatever of my life, because we moved down here when I was five. So yeah. I love Florida, like I love the heat. Like, I love going to visit New York and stuff, but I can't take cold weather anymore, like, at all. Even this little Florida cold be having me, like, shivering. If you um add me on Snapchat and on Instagram, you will see. Like, when it's cold in Florida, I be doing the most. I have a fur jacket, boots, all of that. And it doesn't even get as cold as, like, upper state, up north states. <clears throat> I feel like I'm a little nervous making this video. Okay, I'm not, I don't feel, I know I am a little nervous making this video. Mm. 
this is only technically my second video because I'm redoing my YouTube channel. Even back then, I think I only posted like three times. So it's not like I was consistent before. I'm going to keep those videos up just because I want to see how I came, like where I started from. Because I plan on being like really consistent on YouTube. Because I have a lot of fun on here. Like just chilling in my room, talking to the camera. I feel like I'm interesting enough to, for people to watch. So, <clears throat> But overall, that's actually one of the questions actually. Why am I doing YouTube? Because I'm really bored. And because I love watching YouTube anyway. So it's like, why not just start making YouTube videos? I can sit and talk to y'all. kind of like a why not thing okay so what is my major future dreams where I go to school <clears throat> so I am a junior here at St. Leo University I'm gonna start doing more St. Leo videos I honestly was supposed to do like a room tour a very long time ago but I go to school at St. Leo University. My major is education. I want to teach for four years while I get my master's and then become a principal. I'm putting it out there. In God's name, I will complete that goal. But yes. <clears throat> hmm. So my relationship status, overall it is single, but I don't want to say single because in this season of my life, I'm really trying hard to focus on myself. Like, I'm really trying hard because I feel like a relationship will find me. Like it's easy to get into a relationship. It's easy to settle. I don't want to settle. I refuse to settle, actually. So until the right person comes and, like, God shows me this is the right person, I think I'm just going to focus on myself. The fact that my napkin keeps falling. <clears throat> this is supposed to be a deep talk, and my napkin's just, like, droop, droop, droop every five seconds. But yeah. So single relationship status, but really I'm in a relationship with myself right now. <clears throat> I feel so strong saying that because like if you guys knew me, I used to like always be in a relationship like I would jump relationship 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 like I never really spent time being single this is probably my first time in 20 years of my life being like okay obviously not 20 I wasn't dating from a newborn but y'all get what I'm saying <clears throat> this is my first time really being single really focusing on myself Should I edit my eating out of the video? No, but then that's the purpose of the muck mom. I'm not gonna do that. So anyways, height, I am 5'3", five, 5 five feet 3 inches. <clears throat> I mentioned that in the past video too. My zodiac sign, I am a Pisces. Like, I love me some Pisces. And no, I'm not just saying that. Well, I probably am. I'm probably just saying that because I am a Pisces. I love other Pisces. Like, so many of my friends are Pisces, too. It's crazy. 
Y'all, I dated a Pisces. I would never do that again. Mm -mm. As much as I love Pisces, uh-uh. Um, my favorite... Oh, what's the next question? Oh, do I have any siblings? No, I am an only child. I used to wish I had a sibling though. Like now, obviously I'm grateful because you know, God has blessed me, but I really used to wish I had a sibling. Um, fave movie and favorite book. <clears throat> so favorite movie, it's a mix between The Lion King and Mean Girls. Like I love Mean Girls. It's so funny. Um, Lion King, you know, that's my favorite childhood movie. Love it. So it's a mix between those two probably for my favorite movie. My favorite book, Flowers in the Attic. I love that book. It's crazy because I actually read it when I was like really, really young too, which I would not recommend. Even though I love that book, that's like really adult content in that book. So, mm -mm. So piercings, you guys. I don't have as many piercings now because I actually took a lot out. So I used to, I now I have just two in both ears. But what I used to have was the two in both ears plus two on the actual like top. I don't want to move my wig and show you. But it was like two on the actual like top of the ear. Maybe I'll insert a picture if I can find one. Um, I used to have a tragus. That was really cute. I'm actually probably going to get that back. Or at least do a surface tragus. I really want a surface tragus. I used to have a nose ring. Um, I took that out because I decided to have this bright idea to try and do Army ROTC. And if you know me, my personality cannot handle Army ROTC. I don't know why I did it. I commend you people who do army ROTC like poof I definitely bit off way more than I could chew when I did that decision but I'm not in it anymore I dropped I didn't even last a full semester and I dropped it so I had to take out my nose ring because of that oh I currently have a belly ring that's still here I got it like at 17 when I first came to college um, and I used to have a tongue ring, but I took that out. But yeah, that's it for piercings. So now for tattoos, I have three. I have one on my shoulder. Um, I'm probably going to insert a picture of all of them but I have one on my shoulder that says my um mom's death date the one on my wrist I can show you it just says strength with a cross and then I have one near like my ankle it's a heart and an infinity sign conjoined together that's a matching one with my twin cousin I'm sorry I just got really hyped but I love her My favorite food, I love me some shrimp alfredo.
like especially authentic Italian shrimp alfredo. Oh my gosh. I love shrimp alfredo. I actually just had some yesterday, but I made it. So it wasn't the same, but I still love it. Um, all the jobs I've worked at. I'm going to save that for another video because I feel like I have some funny job stories. And I've worked a lot of places, actually. And the very last question, let me just get rid of this napkin because it's just going to fall every five seconds. The very last question, am I an introvert or an extrovert? I am very introverted. I have like five or six friends. But at the same time, do I have extroverted traits? I can be extroverted, but it's not common for the most part i'm very introverted very to myself um i'm actually trying to work on being less introverted but we'll see how that goes but anyways i know i technically didn't finish eating all the food but that's it for the questions so i'm gonna end this video um i almost finished the pizza that's how much i had of it left it was good reminds me of elementary school didn't open the oreos didn't even eat the chips. But I'll see y'all later in the next video. Bye.